Welcome back to Fallout 76. We are right where we left off at the end of the last episode. We're doing uh, kind of two quests at the same time right now. We're doing this retirement plan. We need to go back to Roxy and let her know that the former raider has been dealt with. But we also want to go over here to Foundation uh, with this photo opportunity thing. I agreed to help Davenport, the overseer's assistant, by taking reconnaissance photos of targets around the crater settlement. We did that. And Ward is going to be very interested to see those things. And I almost bet you when we go back to Ward, uh, he's probably going to have a job for us to do anyway. So, you know, double the reason to go back there and talk to him. He'll give us another retrieve an item job. And we could just forever, over and over again, continue getting our reputation up with these different factions. Because it's so much fun. Attention, citizens. There's Nuclear death from above. Imminent. Please exit the area at your earliest Yeah, what is going on? I wonder why somebody decided to put a blast zone down here. Hmm. Wow, there's already two of them over here. Look at this. These are two blast zones. Another one over here. Man, people are just going nuts though today with the with the nukage. Okay, there's vital equipment. So I wonder why I would wow. want to return the it's photos nice to out. Davenport, what that would do for me. Ward. I've got finally some our medical uh -huh. if you can get Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh okay, sure, sounds right up my alley. Excellent. Fortunately we put tracking transmitters into the really sensitive stuff like mm -hmm. that. Yep. I can show you roughly where it is, but mm -hmm. you'll have to wait until you're closer to get an exact fix on it. Okay. But I have some photos I want to give you. Why? The quicker you recover a missing uh -huh. equipment, the better. Okay. Hey, what do you need? Hey, man, interested in some pictures of the crater? If you've got recent intel on the crater, then I'm definitely interested. We need to keep an eye on those raiders at all times. I can pay you in caps for those pictures. What do you think? Dude, I don't want caps. You get to see charisma. I can use perception. Look around if the raiders attack. Your defenses won't hold. You need this intel to be prepared. I use my charisma. I risked life and limb to get you these. At least make it worth my while. Sure sounds good. No caps needed. Needed. I'm just happy to help you out. Let's do that. That should help reputation more than anything I would imagine. You serious? Well, for whatever it's worth, you've got my gratitude. Hope I'll see you again sometime soon. Take care. Okay. Hoping for a big charisma boost. Eh, it wasn't that big. Wasn't that big. I'm a little disappointed there. Oh well. Oh, now All I'm right. supposed to return to Davenport again? Okay. Well, I mean, as far as our reputation goes, I mean, it went up a little bit. We're a little more than halfway there, but um, we can boost it even more by doing. Um, I need a nap or a refill. Vital equipment here. This is uh, over here. Let's go over here to Beaker or Becker Farm and do this. Just travel all over the map, man. We'll just hop here, hop there, hop everywhere. See this place, see that place. You know, grab this, grab that. Kill this, kill that. That's what we do, man. Oh, that's what we're after. This guy. Oh, it's not looking good for him. Oh, he's dead. There's just too many of them. Golly, there's still a lot of them. <laughs> There's just too many of them. Sorry, dude. I couldn't help you. <laughs> I couldn't help this guy. <laughs> Sorry, bro. Uh, screwdriver. Too bad he doesn't actually have Blackwater Brew on him, but I think we've come up with a pretty good charisma solution, I feel like. We've got... Ooh, ooh there's a legendary here. Troubleshooter's Crossbow here. Plus 30% damage to robots. Sign me up. Boy, do I want that. Being sarcastic, in case you couldn't tell. Stupid Blood Eagle Thief, you got what you deserved. Okay, well, we got the thing for Ward. We could return it to him. Whoa. Oh, explosions. Hey, get out of here. Who do you people think you are? A bunch of dummies shooting at me. <laughs> bunch of idiots. Hey, do you know who you're messing with? Huh? I don't think they know who they're messing with. Uh, let us go um, back to Ward and finish that off. 
Golly, that's way down there, though. Maybe instead we just go up here because we're closer to this. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Let's just go here. Let's do this, man. We'll just travel all over this freaking map. But then after that, I'm not really sure what we're going to do, to tell you the truth, because... I mean... I mean... You can only do these reputation things once a day, right? Um, and this is already the second time I've played oh, today, so... It's not like I'm going to get another reputation quest today. So I'm really not sure... What's going to happen here? I mean, what I'm going to do... I don't know. We'll see what happens. We're here. Maybe I should just go talk to Meg and see what happens. Oh, is Roxy still over here? Taking a moment to herself? I don't blame her, man. That, somebody playing those instruments all the time. Does anybody time. in this goddamn place understand the concept? Can I cross this name off my list or what? You sure can. It's done. Good. I don't even care what you did. I just like to know it's done. I wasn't so going to tell you anyway. Hard work deserves real pay. Now scram, kid. Raider's reputation increased by quite a bit. Not too shabby, really. Completed daily retirement plan. Come on, game, give me my crap. Give me my items I'm not interested in. Combat armor right, arm... Deep-pocketed Raider armor chest. Yeah, whatever. Oh, we've leveled up again. Okay, that's exciting. People around here think we're stealing their shit. Okay, um, so we're here. Let's go see what happens if we talk to Meg, right? Let's go do that. This quest here, it's a main quest. Now that Lou has agreed to help us break into Vault 79, I need to report back to Meg. Let's let's talk to her. I mean, I'm not... There's gotta be some better loot around here. I'm not siding with them. Shit. So I don't really know what's going to happen when I go in here. We'll see. I, I don't know if the game's even going to tell me that I'm at a point at every turn. I don't know, man. We'll see. Again, I wish I could F5 it. But I cannot. Come to think of it, I haven't seen Lou in a while. Oh well. At least he's got you to check up on him. Yeah, at least he's got me to check up on him. Hey, everybody shut up. Alright. Uh, is Lou around here? I'm just curious. He's come back, although she did just say she hasn't seen him in a while. Perhaps not. You're the new guy, aren't you? I seen you talking with Meg and poking around. Fat brings you to me. Mm. Okay. Never mind. We already talked to him about all this. I just wanted to see if there was anything new to talk to him about. So, Lou was originally uh, down here, I believe. In one of these rooms. I don't remember for sure which one it was. This is Lev. So Lou was in... Let's see, was he down here? This may have been Lou's room. No, this is Surge. I'm just guessing, man. I don't know. But remember we found that note of Luz. Yeah, this was Lou's room here. Well, he's not here. No Lou. Okay, I just thought I'd come check. Worth a look. If you ain't with us, you better watch your back. A76. Took you long enough to come back. You get Lou on board with the plan? Uh, sorry, he wasn't home, so I had to go look for him. He's in for the job. I had to take care of some stuff. Lou's good to go. Yeah, Lou ran off to kill himself. I stopped him and got him to help us instead. I'm not going to tell her about this, and I'm not going to tell her that I had to go look for him. I just had to take care of some stuff. Okay, good. Lou's our way in the front door, so... I don't know how we do it without him. All right, so I've been thinking about those plans. Place is secure as hell. Once Lou gets us inside, I'm sure we're gonna meet resistance. Ain't gonna just bowl over and let us loot, so we're gonna need the big guns. Mm. For that, we need Gale. 
Gail's the big green mutant gal you may have seen around, always hanging out with her little girl, Ra Ra. Mm, okay. Ever since Ra Ra met up with Gail in the wilderness, they've been impossible to separate. So, just saying, you may have to convince Ra Ra to let Gail come with us. Good luck, 7 6. Okay, cool. So she's just giving us another quest. Awesome. Alright. Anything else? Oh, Raider's reputation increased quite a bit. Nice! Gail seems to be throwing a fit over there. You're gonna have to calm her down before she's gonna want to do anything for us. Oh no, that doesn't sound good. Quest completed cheating death. Get some more crap I'm not interested in. Quest started fun and games. Recruit Gale and Ra Ra for the Vault 79 heist. Alright, that sounds like fun. So what's the hold up? What's the hold up? Do we up? have Gale for the job or not? Have you seen me leave in the last five seconds? Great. Thanks to that damn broadcast, we got all the rats crawling out of the woodwork. Broadcast? What broadcast are you talking about? For real? Tell me you ain't heard about that garbage bot of a Miss Nanny broadcasting far and wide about some trove hidden in Appalachia. We come back to Appalachia and we're neck deep in these so-called settlers. Not to mention cultists, bloodthirsty bandits, you name it. Hmm, okay. Um... That's it, I guess. We already asked her all these things. Don't forget, Appalachia belongs to us. Yeah. I don't know about that. I don't see Gail over here volunteering for the job yet. You okay. gonna get on that 7-6? Do shut up. Meg thinks we're going to need to bring along the big guns to break into the former government-owned Vault 79, and for that, we'll need to get Gale the Super Mutant on board. I should speak with her. Okay. Gale is in that direction. There she is right there. Let's go talk to Gale. Why does no one listen to Gale? What's wrong? What's wrong with Gale? Gale, why? What's wrong? So many humans around. Makes head hurt. Hmm. Gale needs help. No time to waste making talks with newbies. Go away, stupid human. Oh, I'm not stupid. Well, I can use my charisma here. Oh, Gale, I get it. You're worried and these bozos don't care. I do, though. How can I help you? Hey, calm down. What's going on? What's your problem? I'm the one who needs your help. Do you want my help or are you just going to insult me, you big green oaf? Uh, I don't even know what to do here. I'll be back. Let's use our charisma. Wait. You want to help Gale? For real? This is good! You will help Gale find her! What's wrong? Find who? Uh, yeah, what's up? Rara! Gale's little Rara is in danger! That doesn't sound good. So who's Rara? Rara is precious little human girl. Gale met Rara years ago. Rara was alone. Gale was alone. Now Rara and Gale are together. Rara take care of Gale. Gale take care of Rara. Rara is what matters most to Gale. Sounds like a nice relationship. Well, well where is she? Under big building. Rara go up rocks, into pipe, and don't come out. <laughs> Gale can't follow Rara. Pipe too small for Gale, but maybe you fit. Building full of machines. Hmm. Don't know how, but Gale think it makes lots of steel. Hmm. There's a lot of candidates for what building it is. What happened to her? Gale and Rara was playing near the big dirty water place. We play hide and seek. I spy. Tag. Rara always bring her favorite toy. While we play, something steal Rara's toy, so Rara chases it. I chase Rara, but thing run up rocks and into pipe. So does Rara. Now Rara don't come back out. So did something bad happen to Rara? Hmm. Gale would be so sad and so mad if something bad happened to Rara. All right. Well, why is <laughs> why is Rara? Gale, not sure what you mean. Is this some stupid human question? 
or you somehow making fun of Gail's smarts. <laughs> Either way, question is a waste of time, and Gail has big, strong, crushing arms. That good answer for you? <laughs> that was funny. Why is raw raw? Uh, okay, no time to waste. Tell me where she is and how to save her. Rara went into pipe at Big Steel Place, but Gale too big, so Gale need you to go after Rara. Gale waited and called to Rara, but Rara did not come back, so Gale is worried. Gale come back for help to get human to go in pipe to get Rara, but no one listened to Gale until you. Now you go to pipe and go get Rara out. Easy for someone small and weak like you. Wait, watch who you're calling small and weak, Gale. All right, uh, let's see here. Uh, oh, got it. I'll head to Grafton Steel and see if I can find Rara. You can on me, or can you be more specific specific about where to find her? Well, it sounds like I already know where she is, but let's ask this question. Go to big building where steel made, near yucky bad water. Under building near rocks, there is pipe. Rara went in pipe, did not come out. You go in, see if she's stuck or maybe in danger. You save Rara, and Gale will love you forever. Mm, I am pretty lovable. Okay, got it. I'll head to Grafton Steel and see if I could find Rara. You can count on me. Good. One more thing. If you be nice to Rara and she likes you, she will be good and helpful. If she don't like <laughs> you, she make things hard for you. <laughs> Rara loves Gale, so life is easy. You are stranger though, so keep in mind. Now okay. go. Hurry. No time to wander <laughs> wasteland doing stupid things while little child is in trouble. Yeah, you don't really know how things work around here, here Gale. I'm going to do exactly that. I'm going to wander the wasteland doing stupid things. Let's see if we could talk to her again. You find Rara yet? You better not have bad news, or it be bad news for you. Mm, I'm still looking. Don't worry, I'll bring her back. Hurry up, stupid human! <laughs> uh, Gale, sorry. Not mean to call you stupid. Gale just angry at self! Alright, it's okay, Gale. It's okay, I understand. It's okay. So. Gale's little girl and best friend, Ra-Ra, got separated when she ran into a ventilation shaft chasing after an animal. Gale won't help us raid Vault 79 until I bring Ra-Ra back to Crater. So we get that to do. Let's go ahead and exit this place here. And we need to go back to Davenport and Sutton for reasons I don't understand. And then we got to go back down to Ward at Foundation to return the items that we retrieved for him to get our reputation boost. And um, then I guess we'll talk to Paige and um, see what Foundation wants us to do next. This is all very exciting. Oh yeah, play that tuba. Play it. Yes. Play the tuba. No, don't stop. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't want you to stop. Huh. Blood eagles are crazy. Tuba's gone. <laughs> I don't know where the, the tuba went. Well, that's too bad. I was going to join in. Maybe play the banjo while he played the tuba. Put him out of their misery, yells some random raider. Oh, look, she's sitting here eating some noodles. Look at that. I told those scavengers to hand it over. Not my fault they didn't want to listen. Okay. So, um, let's go to our quests. We're going to turn this one off for the time being. We're going to go back to our daily quest. We're going to turn on photo opportunity. We're going to show it on the map. It's here in Sutton. We are going to fast travel back to the Overseer's home here. <laughs> and then we'll talk to Davenport. I mean, what am I going to do? Say, oh, sorry, man. I gave the photos to somebody else. Uh, I don't know. First time I've done this. Not sure what's going to happen. Not sure why I even have to come back here. Okay.
All right, downstairs we go. All right, Davenport, whoa. Ah, you've returned. Do you have the photographs I asked for? <laughs> uh, I had them, but I got jumped by raiders and they took the pictures. I sold the pictures to someone else or I'll let you know. Well, let's, since we still have this charisma, let's use it. Oh, my. I knew the job would be risky. I... I suppose I should have made that more clear. <laughs> Since you risked harm in order to help us, it would hardly be fair to let you leave empty-handed. Here, please accept these caps in gratitude for your efforts and your bravery. Mm -hmm. You should come and visit again sometime. I might have a new assignment for you. Cool, I can't wait. All right, cool. We get caps and reputation. Ooh, 40 caps. <laughs> Oh, I'm maxed out on my um, script. We need to go. We need to go pay a visit to Murmurg. We gotta go do that right now because when we go back to Ward, we're gonna get more script. And if we're maxed out, well, then we're not getting the full benefit. So let's cruise on over to Murmurg and s play the slot machine of crappy legendary items. Plus, I have more legendary items I need to scrap. So yeah, we definitely need to go over to the Rusty Pick. Let's say hi, say hi to Murmurg again. Bring up our map here. The rusty pick is right here. Nice. Let us go. Let us go to the pick that is rusty. I mean, I don't know, man. Um... I'm mostly interested in weapons. I'm still looking for a good close-up, you know, crowd control kind of weapon. The weapon I've got, my lever action rifle, is not good for when the enemy gets close to me. So I need something for up close and personal battle. But I may also be interested in um, legendary armor, something that would give me some char a charisma boost too. So... Let's see. There she is. For a moment, I was worried she was going to be here. All right, Murmurg. Let's try a three-star legendary ranged weapon. That's what I want. Yes. Ugh. Okay, I have zero use for that. Let's try again. Okay, do not care for that at all. Next. Furious, so I finally get a Furious and it's a stupid pipe revolver. Damage increased after each consecutive hit on the same target. 25% faster fire rate. Your VAT's critical meter refills 15% faster. Well, this is intriguing at least. This might be worth a look at. Let's go over here and get rid of some of this other crap though. Yes. Okay. Uh, I do not want this at all. So we're going to turn this back in for 40 script. Uh, hints to... Okay, this is my weapon. Generating sturdy raider luck lag. I mean, it's cool that it's regenerating. That might be... Well, let's see. I don't need this troubleshooter's crossbow. That's for damn sure. I don't need this Troubleshooter's Missile Launcher, that's for damn sure. The two-shot combat shotgun is something I was thinking about maybe trying out as well. Um, hmm, interesting. Let's see here. Apparel. Right now, I'm wearing this and left arm. So this other legendary thing that I've got in here, this left leg. What am I wearing on my left leg instead of this? This thing. Cloaking, pocketed, combat, armor, left leg. This thing's pretty cool. Three stars, plus one endurance, being hit in melee generates a stealth field once per 30, 30 seconds. 75% chance to reduce damage by 50% while sprinting. I mean, I guess that's kind of cool. 
This thing here is kind of cool in that it's regenerating, but I've already got a regenerating. I don't feel like I need another one, so let's go ahead and get rid of this. Regenerating sturdy. Okay. Alright, so like I said, I'm kind of intrigued maybe with this um, Furious Pipe Revolver we just got here. We may be, may be able to mod it. I don't think I could make put an automatic receiver on a on a revolver though, so I don't think this is what I want. I don't think it is. I kind of want, and I think I want like a two shot or a quad shot or something. This thing's only level 20. That's a problem with this thing. I should probably just go ahead and get rid of this. I'm, I don't think I'll use that. Let's um, let's get a couple more things here. Let's try again. Legendary range weapon. Spend 100. Suppressor's short laser pistol. Reduce your target's damage output by 20% for 3 seconds, plus 33% VATS hit chance, plus 1 agility. Okay, that's kind of useless to me. I need to be careful though, because she's going to run out of script to trade. And she's only got 56 now, so I could go ahead and trade this in. Now she's only got 16 left. So I'm thinking maybe I should just go ahead and stop here for now. I don't think I'm going to be able to use this thing. And like I said, this thing's only level 20. So, um... I kind of wish that there was a, uh... Weapons workbench in here. Tinker's workbench. But I'd kind of like to look at a weapons workbench. Just to see if I could do anything. With, um, you know. Join the auto miner support squad. Bunch of weaponry in there. Well, I didn't get the pie. That's alright. So this place really is like a friggin' gambling hall. You gamble with Murmurg and then you gamble on trying to get a piece of pie. Oh well, that's fine. You know, we stop by. Uh, it seems like I get script left and right now, so it doesn't take long before I get back up to a thousand. So we'll just keep trying. Keep trying here and there. I'd love it if I got a couple more uh, charisma boosting armor pieces. Then I wouldn't have to worry about the Mothman eggs anymore. But uh, that's not a horrible solution that we've got going on there. Okay, back to foundation we go. We'll talk to Ward and then we'll go talk to Paige and we'll see what they want us to do next. Because I'm, I'm assuming they're going to have a new quest for us as well. Just like Meg had a new quest for us up at Crater. So this is kind of exciting to see what new stuff that she's got. Or Paige has waiting for us. I hear the name Paige in my head. It's a girl's name. <laughs> in my experience, my lifetime, I haven't known any dudes named Paige. I've only known women named Paige. Okay, I don't have any quests selected. Vital equipment. You never know where Ward's going to be, man. Those Mothman cultists give me creeps. They're all just crazy. What's that, John? He's just sitting here with his buddy. Go see Sonny if you're looking to trade. Okay. Don't I see there. you have our missing property. I do. And you know what? I'm going to donate my reward to Foundation because that's the kind of guy that I am. You are? That's very generous. I am generous. Foundation thanks you. That multiscope is critical. It's critic. <laughs> we'll never get to hear the rest if of that sentence. If you're looking sentence. to trade, check out Sonny's. Oh, thanks, no person. No longer stop. Okay, that Water quest is completed. Ice. Water is go back over here. Ice. Trade secrets. Let's do it, man. Let's go return to Paige. Let's do this. Huh? We made a lot of friends here in Foundation. Nobody's special yet, though. I can't believe I lost my I know what you mean. Saves. All right, let's go down in here, man. Into Founders Hall. Whoa, that's a great picture. I love that picture. That's one of my favorite ones. Every time it pops up, it's like, Mega Sloth in your face. Oh, Paige is in a different place. Paige is over here. So just in case you don't remember, the Motherlode's field test went successfully but did not go unnoticed. 
I need to head to Foundation to meet up with Paige and Dr. Hornwright. You've secured our way down to the vault pretty handily, haven't you? <laughs> I just can't believe your luck in finding Dr. Hornwright. Yeah. Um, it was pretty lucky. Is she here already? She's getting some equipment brought down, I think. Better run, unless you want to find yourself carrying consoles around. That's fine. Oh, but before you get going, though, let's talk business. All right. I've been working on the next problem we need to solve for busting into Vault 79. That doozy of a laser grid. I figure we got some experienced scavengers in Foundation already. Folks who know a thing or two about busting bunkers. Small ones, anyway. Thing is, before I even start asking around, our youngest scavenger pops up to tell me she's got it handled. Handled! Before I even told her the problem. Hmm, okay. Can you be more specific? Uh, what are you talking about? Oh, right. Sorry. I've been focusing on the problem too long. Tunnel vision. Let's see. Uh, basically, the problem is that there's really serious laser grids. The kind you can't just cut the power to disable. It's like nothing I've ever seen before. If they lose power for even a fraction of a second, they'll lock the whole thing down for hours. Days, maybe. Okay, well, do you think she can do it, whoever this is? Honestly, maybe she's tougher than she seems. She's been with us for a while, so I can vouch for her loyalty at least. She said she has a way to beat the grid, so I'm inclined to believe her. Anyway, her name is Jen. Go talk to her, and I'll get back to work on figuring out a plan for these military-grade turrets. Okay, cool. This is a talk to Jen. That's fine. Get some reputation. Ooh, look at it go. That reputation is a-climbing. It's a-climbing. Item reward. Evening. More crap that I don't want. And, um... That's kind of cool. Pip-Boy 2000 Mark 7 paint. I guess that's fun. Quest started Invisible Ties. Invisible Ties page told me about someone who could help us with the laser grids in Vault 79. I should talk to Jen in Foundation. Well, Jen... You happen to be right here. Hi, Jen. How are you? Am I over encumbered? I'm over encumbered now because this game keeps throwing crap at me with these rewards. <laughs> um, let's see here. I know there's a uh, chemistry bench in here. And I could go Seems ahead and like scrap as soon some as stuff here. One thing in this place, another break. I don't know why I have this. We're gonna scrap it. Um a board. Combat armor, right arm, don't care. Heavy combat armor chest piece. I mean, that's pretty good stuff. This marine wetsuit, I don't think is what I want either. And, um, submachine gun, not interested. Urban operative under armor. Hm. Wood right arm, who cares? Got my weight down to a manageable level for now. We're gonna have to take care of some do another bout of inventory management off camera here pretty soon, my favorite. All right, Jen, I'm going to talk to you. I take it you talk to Paige. Yeah, he said that you found out about the job and wanted to help. I did and I do, yep. But there's something we need to take care of first. It'll be worth it. Okay, well, what can I help you with? So, okay, hilariously, I'm looking for something that is designed to be invisible. Untraceable. It's a suit that hides you from everything, even laser detection grids. Which would help out with Vault 79, right? Hmm. Well, if I was smarter, I could say nothing is completely untraceable. Uh, let's see, what's my intelligence at? Let's leave. Take a look. My intelligence... Ooh, is it five? Yeah, I don't think I'm going to get up to twelve. <laughs> I don't think I am. Man, my intelligence used to be higher. I think, but then I've taken points out of intelligence and spread them around. But yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to get it up to freaking 12, man. That's seven, a boost of seven, for those of you who can do math. Yeah, I don't think it's going to happen. I take it you talked to Paige. Mm-hmm. Yep. I did. 
Uh huh. What can I help you with? So okay, it's a suit that. All right. Well, um, let's see here. How will it help with the vault job? We could just disable the whole grid. Government facilities usually have a lot of security redundancies. There's almost no way to cut the lines fast enough to get past their laser grids. So what if security just can't even see that you're there? That's what this tech does, and I know how to operate it. Okay. Well, why not just take down the whole, whole security system? Because then the facility will almost certainly go into complete lockdown, and you'll have to wait until it cycles back up. Okay. So how do you know about this tech and how it works? Would you believe me if I told you I learned about it from a spy? Hmm. Maybe. Why do you know a spy? I didn't have much choice in the matter. I assure you. Can we hold any further questions until I get to the point? Jeez. Um. All right. Continue. I know it's asking a lot, but you just gotta trust me for now. All right. Fine. How do we find something that's designed not to be found? Nothing is completely untraceable. Think of it like a swimmer that's underwater. It might take a while, but they have to pop up for air, right? So there's always brief moments of exposure, even if it's only exposed to certain eyes. You get what I'm saying? Hmm. Do I? Um. I don't know, man. I don't follow. Okay. So the tech makes you go invisible. But it can't do it all the time. It uses a lot of power, and it has to turn off sometimes. When the power runs out, things that know to look for it are going to be able to track it. Specifically, things that are from the same manufacturer. Those things might relay the sighting, just because most everything keeps a log of what it sees—a memory, right? Hmm. Okay. Uh. Right. Are you just agreeing out of anxiety? Okay, I'll try to boil this down while sounding five percent less confusing. Let's see. We need to go take out a Liberator bot to see if it has a record of another piece of Chinese tech coming through here. Hmm. Why a Liberator in particular? Liberators like to gossip. Speaking in lay terms, they ping each other whenever they see something interesting. It's actually kind of a design flaw. Oh, okay. Well, then I will bring you a liberator. All right. I'll see if we have anyone around here who can help out with the next part. Oh, okay. Well, um, Paige said you're one of their best scavengers. How long have you been doing it? Oh, well, my parents both used to take me along when they went scavenging. They were really good at it, so I picked up some good pointers. So I guess I've been doing this most of my life. I guess a lot of people born after the war and outside the vaults could say the same. Okay, um, you should ask Dr. Penelope Hornwright for help when you see her. I feel like I recognize that name. Is she good with robots? I can do electrical stuff, but hacking and whatnot is beyond me. Okay, um, you probably recognize her last name from her family's business. Oh, of course. We were planning to pick apart one of those air purifiers to see if we could get them going again. I'll have to ask her about that too. Okay. Well, let's ask this question just because I like to hear her talk. What's the point of all this? Wow, existential. <laughs> for a perfectly preserved slice of pie, maybe. <laughs> I'd kill someone for a great slice of pie. Full disclosure. If you help me find the robot, we can find a spy suit, and then I can wear the spy suit for the vault job. Got it? All right. See you later. I've got a liberator to nab. Be safe out there. Okay. So, he invisible tried. ties. He's like a real stick in the mud sometimes, but he's held this group together through a lot of hardship. Oh, okay. Um, invisible ties. I need to kill a liberator and then collect it for Jen's plan. If we show that on the map, we'll see that it's going to be over here, unsurprisingly, near Vault 76. Because... If the game didn't send me here, I was going to say, well, I know where I could find vo uh, viol violators, liberators. They're right here by Vault 76. They always are. So it's kind of cool that the game is going to send me there. As far as um, the fun and games thing, well, this one here is going to take us to... You should uh, consider press this the place a fresh start. Hold on. They took me in years ago and became my family. Mm -hmm. They could be the same for you. Okay, great. 
Uh, yeah, so this quest here would take us to Graft and Steel. Okay, so we could pretty easily go over to Vault 76, take out a Liberator. I mean, we'll be done with this in two seconds, man. Liberators are cake. I figured it was going to have to be like a, uh, a certain type of Liberator, like a high-level Liberator or something. But pff, apparently not. Okay, we know there's Liberators over here. I mean, I really even hate to use my good weapon. The only thing is that they sh tend to shoot you before you get on, get close enough to them. Boing! There it goes. <laughs> uh, steel scrap. Kill a liberator and collect its body. Um. Oh wait a minute. I maybe have to hit space. Yeah, collect liberator. There we go. Okay. Well, there you go. That was easy. <laughs> Deactivated liberator added. Return with the liberator. Um, I should take the Liberator back to Jen and Foundation. Yeah, we, I should, shouldn't I? Let's go do that. I mean, it doesn't get much easier than that. I mean, come on. Oh, hold on, we gotta wait around here. It's pretty cool sound effects that those Liberators make, huh? I like it. Yeah, I was thinking maybe... You can't just get any Liberator. You've got to get the blah 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 Liberator. And you can only find those at this location. But nope. Any old Liberator. I think it was a level 1 Liberator too. Probably didn't even need to use my sword. I just used my bare fists. But anyway, we're here. Alright. Alright. Back to, uh, Jen. In Foundation. In Founders Hall. Um, between Crater and Foundation, I like Foundation better. Um, it's not a mess. Like, uh, Crater is, Crater's just a mess. It's just garbage everywhere. Heck, they've even left dead bodies laying around. Uh, it's just, I just don't I don't like that I don't like clutter I don't like that I, I feel very uncomfortable there but here um, not that this place is perfectly great either I mean look they've got crap laying on the ground as well but it just doesn't seem as bad to me you're over here now oh what's this return Let's with the liberator the hand. Oh, what's this quite welcome. wait oh ah, hello again okay Put that robot on my workbench will you it's tutti fruity Hi, Tutti Fruity. How are you? Oh, I want to pet the cat. Pet, pet, pet. Oh, I want to pet the kitty. Oh. Tutti Fruity. <laughs> Kill Tutti Fruity. No, I'm not. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Come on. What do you think I am? A monster? Jeez. Uh, here's Penelope Hornwright. Hi, Penelope Hornwright. Ah, hello again. Put that robot on my workbench, will you? Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? What's up, Buttercup? Hmm, so uh, where did y'all come from? Oh, I joined up with them north of here a while back. They seem to be from all over this region. My family used to live in what's now the Capital Wasteland. Okay, what do you do around here? Mostly, I keep an eye on the area around Foundation. I look for good things to bring back and keep an eye out for anything hazardous. If the super mutants are on the move or a bunch of scorched move into the area, Ward needs to know as soon as possible. Oh, I'm sorry. Were you still talking? I was looking at the cat. See you around. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to end this episode here. When we come next time, we'll put the Liberator on the table. And uh, we'll see what happens next. Maybe we'll get another big giant charisma. Charisma. I keep saying charisma. We'll get another big giant reputation boost with these guys. I mean, we're almost to the next level. I wonder what it is. Exciting stuff ahead. Thanks for joining me, everybody. I hope you had a good time. If you did... Maybe let me know. Maybe a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I sure hope you join me again in the next episode.